Once upon a time, in a cozy little farmyard, there lived a small and vibrant hen named Rosie. Rosie had beautiful, red feathers that stood out from the rest of the farm animals. She was always cheerful and loved to explore the farm, looking for seeds and bugs to eat. One sunny morning, while Rosie was pecking the ground for breakfast, she discovered some wheat grains scattered near the farmhouse. Excitedly, she clucked and called out to her farmyard friends, Look, everyone! I've found some delicious wheat grains. Who will help me plant them? The lazy dog, the sleepy cat, and the chatty duck were lounging nearby, basking in the warm sun. They lazily opened their eyes and looked at Rosie, but none of them volunteered to help. The dog yawned and said, I'm too busy sleeping, Rosie. Planting seeds sounds like too much work. The cat stretched and replied, I'm too busy grooming myself to bother with planting seeds. The duck quacked, I have better things to do, Rosie. Sorry. But Rosie was determined. She knew that if she wanted to enjoy the wheat, she would have to work hard to make it grow. So, without any help from her friends, she began to plow the soil, digging small holes with her beak. Afterward, she carefully dropped the wheat grains into the holes and covered them with soil, patting it down gently. Days turned into weeks, and the rain and sun helped the seeds sprout and grow into green stalks. Rosie watered the plants and protected them from pests, always keeping a watchful eye. The dog, cat, and duck watched her from afar, but they still didn't offer any help. Finally, the wheat grew tall and golden. It was time for Rosie to harvest the wheat and turn it into flour to make delicious bread. She called out to her friends once again, who will help me harvest the wheat and turn it into flour? The dog, cat, and duck quickly gathered around, excited at the prospect of fresh bread. They exclaimed, we want to help. But Rosie, remembering their previous lack of support, shook her head and said, No, my friends. I asked for your help when I planted the seeds, but none of you were willing to lend a hand. Now, I will enjoy the fruits of my labor alone. With a heavy heart, Rosie harvested the wheat and carried it to the farmhouse. She ground the wheat into flour and kneaded the dough working hard to make the bread. The delicious aroma of freshly baked bread filled the farmyard, and Rosie enjoyed her meal, feeling satisfied and accomplished. As Rosie savored each bite, the dog, cat, and duck watched her with longing eyes. They realized their mistake and felt remorseful for not helping their friend when she needed them. From that day on, they understood the importance of teamwork, cooperation, and hard work. The moral of the story is that we should always be ready to lend a helping hand to others. Just like the little red hen, when we work hard and help each other, we can achieve great things together.